Hi guys! So today I have a card to share. It's been a while since I've made a card. It's just been really busy. I've had a lot of work to do. And I just really haven't had the mojo. Like when I finish my the work that I have to do, I just, I don't know. I can't really think of any card to make. But yesterday, Steph had put up a challenge. And Steph is Enchanted Steph here on YouTube. She had put up a challenge for her daughter Ava. Ava's turning 5 years old. And I really wanted to join in. I love to make cards for kids, so I just really wanted to make a card for her. So here's the card I made. It's a stair step card, and I'll show it to you. Um, here it is. It's pretty big. I think it's about seven, seven inches wide, and height. I think it's about five, maybe five and a half inches. So there it is, and it's a regular stair step card, the only thing is I added the backing, um, I added this backing up here. I have to add more cardstock in the bottom because it's kind of heavy, so I'll do that once the stickles dry. But there is what it looks like, um, and I'll show you a close up of that, so it'll focus, uh, but yeah, that's what it looks like. I'll show you a close up when I show the products. So first I used... Um, these thickers, they're the Amy Tangerine Scene Thickers, and they are this glittery silver thickers, they're really pretty, um, and I use those to spell Ava right here, Let's see if it'll focus, there we go, so it says Ava, and I put a exclamation point as well, then I used this bling that I had gotten at the dollar store, and I used it to emphasize the carpet leading up to the, what is that, the ballroom, I guess. So I used that. Then I used the Amy R, it's the Simply Enchanting stamp set. And I used it for May All Your Dreams Come True, um, May Your Day Be Like a Fairy Tale, and Happy Birthday. So I stamped those on the middle paper, so here's that one, there's the other one, and then I put stickles around them just to make them pop a little more. Then I used the Cartabella Paris Girl, and I used this for the sides, so this paper with the script on it, that's from there, and then this pink paper, the bottom part, is from there as well. Then I used the Doodlebug Design Lovebirds, and I, I used it for this middle paper. It has those little doily type things on it. I used so these stickers, they're by Sticko, and I just used a few flowers from there. You can, oh it's kind of dark back there, you can see them there, there we go. So I used those, and then I used one right there. Then I used this, and this is the Cinderella pack from Hallmark. I got this at Walmart. And I used this scene card, and it's just the top portion. So that top portion is from there, and then right here where this line begins, and then that's pattern paper and such. So there's that, and then the stickers I also use from there. See, there are these clear stickers. So the stickers from there are the Mice Dancing, and then the Fairy Godmother, those stickers, and then these over here. Oh, and I also use this little bird. And I backed the little bird with white paper because they are clear, and I wanted him to be standing atop the card. So I backed him with white paper. Then I used this sticker sheet, also by Sticko. And I use this for the little turtle right there. And also these flowers over here. And finally, I use the Some Odd Girl Princess Tia stamp set. And I use the princess and the frog. So here's the princess. I colored her in with my Spectrum Art. Oh, I messed up the stickles. I'll fix that. But there she is. And then here's the frog. So there is my card for Ava. I hope she likes it. 
And I hope you guys can join in. It lasts quite a while. Um, it ends November 22nd, I believe. Um, I'll put the link down below if you want to check it out. And thanks for watching. Bye.